Canada's Parents and Grandparents Program PGP, has seen a record increase in the number of family members of existing Canadian residents reuniting with their relatives in the country. According to the latest data from Immigration, Refugees and Citizenship Canada, 27,195 new permanent residents arrived in Canada through the PGP last year, more than double the previous year's number of 11,740. Due to existing family members sponsoring their parents and grandparents, the PGP numbers suffered during the pandemic. In 2020, only 10,455 new permanent residents were welcomed under the PGP. However, as overall immigration figures began to pick up again, so did the numbers of the PGP, rising by 12.3% in 2021. To qualify under the PGP, the applicant must pay 1,050 Canadian dollars, and the process takes up to 39 months. Once the Canadian citizen or permanent resident submits an interest in sponsoring their relatives, they receive an invitation to apply and must then submit two applications to the PGP. If approved, the sponsor signs an undertaking to provide support, including basic needs, for 20 years starting from the date their relatives become permanent residents of Canada. In the 2023-2025 Immigration Levels Plan, Ottawa has set a target of bringing in 1.45 million immigrants within three years, including the PGP applicants. The eligibility criteria include being at least 18 years old, having Canadian residency, sufficient funds to support the parent or grandparent, and meeting all other requirements under the Immigration and Refugee Protection Act and the Immigration and Refugee Protection Regulations. The sponsors who live outside Quebec must provide financial support for sponsored family members for 20 years, repay any provincial social assistance, and agree to certain responsibilities in the sponsorship agreement. However, due to past criminality and financial troubles, some Canadian citizens or permanent residents may be ineligible for the PGP.